previously we created F major scale. Now let us move to the next scale. Now, what is our what is our what is our method? What we are doing is we are going down because we're dealing with flats. Um, we're dealing with flats, and we're saying our musical alphabet backwards. So what are we? Uh, what did we discover? The first four or the first half of the scale that we have becomes the last half of the next scale that we need. So we've learned that B flat is the first flat in music. And so all Bs from this point on in the flat section will be flattened from this point on. Okay, and so now the first tetrachord which is the last tetrachord of the scale that we have now. That is correct because we borrowed that from F major. Now, we need to find out something about the first tetrachord. All right, B flat, C, D, E. Let's play it. Okay, there, see, that's not gonna work because it's a whole step. So we must flatten the E. Than what we had before. Okay, so let's come back to our chart and flatten the E. All right, so B flat major has a B flat and an E flat. Now let's go again. B flat, C, D, E flat, F, G, E. Okay, now there's always a trick to everything. We will notice that with each series of notes that we deal with, of course, after we would have brought down the flats that we have already established, okay, what the new thing that we're doing is we are flattening the fourth note. Okay, uh, but let's look at our order of flats here, okay, and we notice that E flat is the second flat that happens in music, and that's our B flat major scale, 